Well, have you seen this video? A brazen robbery caught on camera as a Brooklyn bishop delivered his service. Yeah, three masked men robbed the bishop of over a million dollars in jewelry, and it was all seen on the church's live stream video. Let's get right to Fox 5's Robert Moses. He's live in Canarsie, Brooklyn, with the latest. Robert? Tashani and Dan, the robbery happened here at the church on Remsen Avenue in Canarsie. The bishop believes that he was targeted for some reason. This is a man who is no stranger to the headlines or to the law. Yo, yo. All right, right, right. All right, right. As Bishop Lamar Whitehead right. delivered his sermon inside his church in Canarsie, the leaders of Tomorrow International Ministries, police say three masked, armed men burst in and stole more than $1 million worth of jewelry, including a Rolex, from the bishop and his wife. The church's live stream captured the robbery. When I see them come into the sanctuary with their guns, I told everybody, get out. As he later recounted on Instagram, Whitehead feared the men would harm his parishioners. They didn't fire any shots, but Whitehead says they stole plenty. I took my watch, took my jewelry, took my bishop's ring, um, took my wedding band, um, they took and then they took my bishop's cross. Police say the robbers fled on foot, got into a white Mercedes Benz, and drove away eastbound on Avenue D. Whitehead has been in the news before. Besides making an unsuccessful run for Brooklyn Borough President, in May, he claimed he was trying to negotiate the surrender of Andrew Abdullah, who at the time was wanted for shooting and killing Daniel Enriquez aboard a Manhattan-bound Q train. Whitehead drove his Rolls Royce to the 5th Precinct to, in his telling, facilitate the surrender. But police arrested Abdullah without Whitehead's help. With Whitehead now back in the headlines, he responded to critics who accuse him of being too flashy. You know, it's my prerogative to purchase what I want to purchase. If I worked hard for it, I can purchase what I want to purchase. We mentioned that police say the robbers got away in that white Mercedes. One more clue that you should hear, it has New York plate KMZ5464. Again, KMZ5464. Whitehead is no stranger to the law. He served five years in prison for a $2 million identity theft scam.